yeah. Uh, what kind of man are you looking for, honey? Tom. Yo, is she the Kevin Samuel? I've seen her before. Tom She's the Kevin Samuel. Financially secure, loyal, responsible, honest, kind, authentic, thoughtful, a good communicator, athletic, health conscious, tall. <laughs> I'm not finished. <laughs> Affectionate, emo emotionally available. He must be a gentleman, hygienic, has nice teeth, patient, dress sophisticated. Literally has a list. Not I'm, I'm saying, like, when women say, and when people say, like, have a list, I get it. But this is this is scary. This is almost scary, almost. Not gonna lie. Let me let me know. Everybody this. got baggage. Some people's baggage got them. <laughs> That's you. Ella, where are you calling us from? I'm calling from Seattle, Washington. Yeah. Shout out. To, first of all, first and foremost, before because I already started off bad. Shout out to these two beautiful black queens. You know what I'm saying? In love, and uh, and on on, on both of their endeavors in life. I hope. Nothing but greatness comes from whatever, you know what I'm saying, they do. And beauty, uh, just amazing things blossom. You know what I mean? Disclaimer, I ain't really know how to, uh, yeah. Seattle, Washington, how old are you? I'm 40. Oh. 40, you have any kids? Single on YouTube Live. This single. I have two. Two kids, 40. Okay. Two kids, how old are your children? 23 and um, one will be 18 on Christmas. Okay, same man? No. No. Have you ever been married? Mm, she's... Th this, okay. This is why I had a problem. I don't know if she got any backlash. I don't know too much. But I remember this lady. She was around the time... She was out around the time of Kevin Samuels, bro. I'm not... I know I'm not bugging. I've seen him before when Kevin Samuels was alive and doing, and doing these... She was around. My problem is, this is the problem. People have a problem with what Kevin Samuels was saying, but women were coming on to his show and asking questions, and he was being blunt and honest. And and some of the some of the things I can understand he conveyed, and uh, in a in a harsh, in, in, I'm not even gonna lie, he was he wasn't. I don't think he was really down talking women. I just think he was he wasn't coddling women, and the internet didn't like that because. If we go back, and when the dudes would call up there, he would vi he would go even harder on the dudes. I've been was saying that he was violating the, the men far worse than what y'all see in the women. He was like straight out just, and 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 I get it. You know what I'm saying? When a woman is being, it seems as if a woman is being like tore down and all that. We we should definitely be opposed to that, no matter what. Understandable. But they're calling up and he's giving them actually good answers. Yeah, I may not agree with his delivery, but the answers usually eight eight to nine times out of ten was sanctioned. You feel me? Some solid good advice. He didn't coddle them though, so it wasn't easy. It wasn't easy to like. I don't I don't know how to say it wasn't easy to adjust to adjust or to intake what he was saying. He was giving some solid advice. I feel as though this woman is going to do the same exact thing. I've watched... I don't think I've watched her videos before, but I've seen her speaking like up until these points of asking questions and stuff. And I just feel like it's going to be the same approach. But because it's coming from a woman, which I don't have a problem with, but because it's coming from a woman, I feel as though the internet or, or whoever is going to take it a lot, a lot different. Which is fine. But it's just, it's just interesting to know that. Mary? Yes. Okay, when did you get divorced? Or maybe she might, she might September call September 15th. Maybe. It was finalized. Oh, this year? Yes. You just got divorced like a month ago. I've been waiting month? to get on the show. You say gotta be single, so <laughs> hurry up and got that. Oh, you already ready, girl. You've been divorced for a month. It's that it's time for the next one. Time to, yes. Yes, ma'am. So you don't have to answer, but do you want to share why you got divorced? Um, my... It was an abusive relationship, but oh, then he man. turned into... We're not, we're not jacking that. Abusive relationship. Kind of need to expand upon... Uh, Expand upon that because abusive can mean most people. Addict and um, violence. He, oh, I mean, physically. It wasn't his. I don't believe that it was his fault that he turned into a mess addict. He was trying to mess. Um, what the? Self wait, 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 wait. I'm dragging this video out. I am. My fault though. Meth. Was my son white? Was he called? Was he Caucasian? Meth. I don't know that. I, mean. I ain't gonna sit here and even lie to y'all. I've made this about race. I don't know meth addicts. I've lived in the hood most all 
Y'all see the bars on the window, B. I don't got to say too much. Long story short, I don't know meth addicts. Who is that? You mean what? I ain't going to say that. Soon, soon, I guess, um, this video will be out. They're going to spin a block on this video. I'm already know. Make sure y'all cut this part, too. Yes. Like, make sure y'all, when y'all cut the clip, you're going to this up. She was run over by the electric company and then overdosed at the hospital. Ooh. There's a lot. Whoa, what's going Whoa. on? Guys, <laughs> a meth head? I'm like, okay. A That's a meth head. A blogger doesn't want to say what she's talking about. The daughter's like, yeah, well, Jeez. I mean... Lie. There's a lot. I'm not gonna lie to you. That's just very understandable. What? What? Turning to substance abuse when you lose a child. Oh, like, oh, you know, you know, yeah. That might be yeah. the most relatable thing I've ever. But seen. meth? I, can't. I ain't gonna lie. meth. I understand. Yes. I can. I can. Sure me too. Even losing your parents, he lost. He almost lost. Siblings, My son, I almost lost. He turned to substance abuse sometimes. Yes. Like it's not that. Crazy. It I can no, it, it's not stuff. uncommon. That's yeah, weird. Yeah. But meth. That is the reason I was like, oh, makes perfect sense. Uh, what kind of man you looking for, honey? Okay, I got a long list. <laughs> you have a long list. A okay. long list. I wrote it down. Um, so he must be spiritual. Um, he needs to enjoy outdoor activities. Um, he must be calm, dominant, respectful. At the real, real luxury is Gucci, Louis Vuitton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Stop promoting this. Scoring now. something amazing. Financially Before. secure, loyal, responsible, honest, kind, authentic, thoughtful, a good communicator, athletic, <laughs> health conscious, tall. <laughs> I'm not finished. <laughs> Affectionate, emo emotionally available. He must be a gentleman, hygienic, has nice teeth. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. The nice teeth kind of fucked me up because her ex was like, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, meth addict, yeah. Yo, that look crazy. <laughs> must have nice teeth. <laughs> My son got dragon teeth. <laughs> yeah, they laugh. Now that you say it, it sounds like everything that she's saying is a job at her ex. You know what I mean? <laughs> Hygienic. Must have a job. Meth. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, <laughs> you ever seen those commercials? Robbing your mother of every possession she owns isn't normal, but our method is. <laughs> <laughs> and they got some nasty looking, all those ones like. <laughs> Everything she's saying is, is like a jab to, to, to the ex. I mean, patient, dressed sophisticatedly, not skinny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Every time she makes this list long, I'm like, this is so unreasonable. And I yes. just do meth. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. And you might yeah, be wondering, why didn't you know meth? <laughs> That's just what I think of every meth head. You know, yeah, I just, just I feel something like. Something through the teeth. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't know why. Yeah. I just, but, but it's, I think it's. They sound like a bad Batman villain. Okay, let's go. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, are all these I just want to know what you're saying. Requirements on your list? Quite, yeah. That's a good um, question. Majority of them are, yes. What's negotiable? Oh, hold on. What's negotiable? Um, if he has facial hair, <laughs> which I didn't even say that. I do. I love facial hair. Um, so he has to be athletic. Yes, and so I. That's with age range too. So I, I was about to say, like my son, she's in her forties. What is she? What is athletic in her eyes? Real, real life question though. Real, real life, real, real spill question. Like guys that are bigger, like he can't be skinny. So skinny is oh, okay. definitely a non-negotiable. Like, okay. she wants to. She wants to. Yeah, like that's for another reason. Matt, that's what it's talking about. My son. Matt, I can't. Give me all my son is from Gotham. <laughs> He's wilding. Right? What? Jesus Christ! My nigga, come on. Yo, another mishap like that, and I'm out. I'm not. I can't even. I'm not even gonna be able to finish this video. It's be wild. Why we gotta go to the the peace pipe? Pause. Why is that now? The next. Stop that. Stop that. Hey, listen, y'all got one more time, and I'm out. Hey, listen. When you're on meth, they're like, yo. No, 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 no. We ain't doing that. What? It's, it's survival. <laughs> yo, I'm trying to get through. Yeah, you know me. Now, what are your deal breakers? I'm assuming you wrote that down. I I did. Okay, so one de deal breaker that I have is that yeah, I do not want to date a guy that um, treats women that he's newly dating based off of um, his previous relationships. Whoa! So but you just made that list that based. Like, um, oh, I used to give you know girlfriends a, a credit card when they go out of town or something, and then you're like you're going out of town with my credit card. And he's like, oh, I don't do that anymore because like the chick, the last chick kept my credit card when we broke up, and she was like. This is a very specific answer. I wouldn't even tell nobody. That. Because you can't use his credit card. Sounds like you might also do meth. That is not an example she pulled out of nowhere. No, yeah, that that's was very specific. That was super specific. Well, obviously. I'm not okay with yeah. you telling me 
you know, things that, you know, you do in the beginning of the relationship and then tell me, oh, you're not going to do that for me because it, it went poorly in, in the relationship previously. That's not okay. But isn't that why you don't want to fuck with skinny dudes? Because your ex is that's a meth head exactly probably really sick. That whole list is based off previous, previous relationship to judge your standards for your future. Yes, it is. Yeah. To Talk to him. Now, I'm going to keep watching. But I suspect the pe reason people sent me this video is because she's got unreasonable standards or whatever. Yeah, she just I'm named it unreasonable. Personally, I'm a little bit sympathetic. Mostly because this is somebody Lost who's been daughter? married for a long time. Okay. Ended up losing her husband due to their child being killed. Yeah, 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 yeah. And they're all grieving and coming Fact. out of it. Now, you can say this woman's delusional, whatever it is, but like... No, 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 no. It's reasonable. It's type reasonable. So long, you have a certain quality. The life. list is crazy. Not ready but everything else makes sense. It's not like some person who's like, I'm done She's with She's trying to this. live life. I just want to be single because I could do better. It's like, yo, her situation... Up. She want to live, she wanna live life, situation, and so part of me has a tremendous amount of like sympathy in that regards. Like, I'd probably be really fucked up too coming out. I'm not saying I would have crazy stands like this, but I'm like, I don't know. To me, it's just one of those things where, I mean, <laughs> I mean I just... on, my, on, my, on my side, I understand. I understand where she come from in this situation. Same, bro. Specific is very fucked up. Yeah, it's very. Fucked up. But at the same time, I'm hearing her talk, and I'm like. You gotta lower some of them standards. I don't think you're ready to date. I got a toothpaste, and you're gonna open your baggage and open all that shit up. I don't think you should date thing that triggered you and that made you. Damn, I'm gonna have to edit this. Nah, B. Um, I don't want a liar. I can't have a lazy guy. Um, he has to be hygienic. Like, mm -hmm. I, I can't have him stinking. Um, that sounds like man. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I can't do this. It's yeah. all based off that. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Probably I, there listen, to all our meth viewers, I respect you guys, okay? <laughs> viewers. The ones what? watching out of a cardboard box, sucking dick right now to get some. What? Like, you know, I've Yo, what you. I tell you, bro? <laughs> Don't that like one more time. Bro. Oh! say that this guy has to be extremely exclusive to me, but I definitely have to feel like I'm, I'm the most important person in your life. So you're open to him having other women as long as you're the main girl? No, I need to feel like I'm the most important person in your life. So if you can accomplish seeing other people while still making it so, I feel like I'm the most important person in your life. Yeah, I'm realizing that open marriages and open relationships are really becoming the norm now. That's cool. Realistically. Like, realistically, if you could do it, like, allow, why not allow the dude to do it? If he could ha hold you down and still have a whole other family and everybody's happy, and everybody's tended to and everybody's taken care of, I'm just saying. It seems most like important the person out. as in the females he's dating or just overall? Most overall, important the most important Whoa, person what? in your life. Over his, what if he has children? Yeah, uh, I would prefer him not to have children. Uh, what's the age range you want to date? You get me and then you lose me. You have kids, though. Have kids. Did she not say that she had children? Yeah. Yes. My girl. Now you have to understand one thing. This is very important. Okay? You have to understand that in your position, you have less and less chances. And your chances are getting You want to feel narrow, more. Okay? You, you're being picky right now. You have less and less chances. What I'm trying to say is that if someone has... Eight. Right, I ain't gonna lie. Look, look, look. I don't know where the homie is about to go. I gotta get out of here. I ain't gonna lie. She already pissed me off with that. I, I want to be the most important person. In, in, I didn't even. I didn't even think to, to name parents. I didn't even say that. Kids was was wasn't on my mind, but it should have been. Uh, I prefer him. Not, I'm out. What are we talking about? Y'all be safe though. You heard? <laughs> Y'all be real safe. She's wigging. Ain't got nothing to say about that. Meth addict got her twisted out, got her twisted out bad, bro. Bad.